follow me on like Instagram lately, you've seen that I have like been put a lot of Instagram stories up where I've been reading books and uh, like this is because like, I do see a lot of value reading books, like I do uh, think that if you want to invest in yourself then you should start reading books, you know read about people that are like slightly further uh, than you are in terms of like whatever you want to be like say you want to be better at sales then you know, read books about people that are really good at sales that really master the art of selling and closing and stuff like that and uh, like I really do want to invest in myself and that is why I've really started like reading a lot of books like reading a lot of like non-fiction books like not like uh, magazines or comic books or anything like that like I do read a lot of non-fiction books uh, like I've seen on my Instagram poll that there's still so many people that don't read books like there's still so many people that uh, they don't see the point in reading or they don't want to you know spend the time sitting down reading the book or anything like that and to be honest I like, I'm not gonna stand here and say like you know or you need to read or you've got to read or you're a fool if you don't read or anything like that because up until I was 18 I hadn't read like a single book by myself like, obviously yeah, I had to read for, for school and stuff like that but like, I didn't read because I wanted to I had read because I had to and then like, around me 18th I started like I wanted to invest in myself more I wanted to improve myself so I did start reading books but I hated reading like I couldn't stand reading it was so boring and I, I was always on the go so I didn't want to like sit down and read a book you know I was always like up and, up and out and active and stuff like that so I didn't want to sit myself down and read the book it was just so boring I just didn't want to do it so I started like looking to like, looking into how could I get the same amount of knowledge but when I was actually like sitting there and reading and like obviously I tried like loads of things but it, like after really looking into it it hit me audio books you know instead of sitting down and, and reading you could actually like listen to it on the go like you know on the train in the bus while you're biking to the gym stuff like that you can just get the same amount of knowledge in but like without reading it and then obviously i tried like loads of different apps for this like i even tried downloading like the audio books like illegally i like, was trying to find like the book i wanted like through torrents and stuff like that but it was, it was just a pain in the ass, it wasn't efficient, it just took too long, I could never find the books that I wanted. And then I found Audible. Like Audible is this, it's like this massive mu uh, audio book library. It's like Spotify for books really. Like you pay a tenner a month, I think, and you've just got like access to like 200,000 audio books and you can just, you know, like they've got all like the most recent titles and you can just find the book you want to read and listen to it. And you can also speed up the book so you can listen to it at like twice the speed and get it like read or listen to the book quicker so anyway audible for me like was the way to go that was like that upped my reading game by so much because i didn't have to sit down anymore i could just get it done while doing my day-to-day -day things you know what i mean i could just do it while while going to the gym or while cleaning up but even while i'm cooking just put on a little audio book and listen to it so anyway uh, if you're interested in like a, a free month on audible so like if you want like your first month for free and after that you pay a tenner a month oh, then uh, <laughs> Then if you're interested in like the first month for free, then click on the link in my description box. Obviously it's an affiliate link, kind of get like a little small percentage if uh, you click on it. But I'm not really asked about that. Like if you don't want to support the channel, then just go onto Google, click on or like type in audible.com and you'll get like the same offer basically. So anyway, I just thought I'd pass on like my my reading hack onto you guys. Well, it's dark in here. So anyway, wanted to pass on my little reading hack onto you guys so you can you know, improve yourself a little bit more, get more intelligence while being on the go. The level of creativity that AR is going to allow us is going to be so remarkable. But the leaders are Facebook and Snapchat because of what they've been buying up, the startups they've been buying up. Um, and then you've got to look at Apple and Google. All right, guys, moment of truth. Will Brampanier hit the ground running in 2018? Hope this goes well. I'm, I'm, I'm not nervous, but... It's one of them, like, I do, I do really, really hope this goes through because, like, I honestly reckon that this is one, like, one of the biggest up-and-coming brands or, like, companies in 2018. I reckon if this all goes according to plan, they will become such a large player in their field and in their, like, uh, market. It's just, it's going to be unbelievable. Wish me luck. Clients, 2018 is a fact closed. That's it, guys. Brampanier 
for 2018 is up and running. You get to a stage though when you start like um, getting like coaching students and like more clients that it doesn't seem it doesn't seem like it's like you're playing a video game. It doesn't seem like like the money comes in. It doesn't feel like it doesn't seem like money. It just seems like yeah numbers. Like it's really weird. Yeah, I like, what you mean. when someone pays me now for like a coaching session. Just got off a Skype call with Bradley Riley and we're going to get a collab in really soon, which I absolutely can't wait for. Uh, like his content has inspired me ever since I stumbled onto his social media a while back. He, he's just smashing it, you know, with his coaching and social media marketing agency. Anyway, a uh, successful little day for me as well in terms of signing the clients and work-wise. I'm, I just want to say like I didn't show the, the client signing to, to show off or anything like that. Like, oh, look at me being successful, you know. It's not about that. It, I, I'm just bringing you guys along with me on my journey. And even if I didn't, like, come to an agreement with that client today, I would still show that on the channel. You know, I'd still document it because it's not about showing off. It's about transparency. It's about, like, showing you guys the highs as well as the lows. And to show you guys that in the end, I, you can live the life you want. You know, you can uh, earn money doing what you love. You can escape the nine to five. And but before I go off on this big mad, you can speech. I do want to say that before anyone else believes it, you need to believe it. You know, it starts with you. Like, you need to like speak life into it. You need to believe it to be true. And like, once you believe it, the whole universe just conspires to make that shit happen. Like. It's the law of attraction, baby. It starts with you. Once you believe it to be true, like you become that person you want to be. And once you portray the person you want to become, people start seeing you as that person you want to be. And I know that sounds all airy fairy, but I hope I sort of like got my point across there. You know, don't train for skill, train for mindset. You know, skill is a commodity, but the mindset is everything. It all starts with the mind. And with that said, I do want to wrap up this video. Uh, like. Uh, subscribe oh, nearly got it in one take oh i can't believe i stumbled at the last bit anyway guys like this video if you got something out of it subscribe to the channel for more click on the little bell so you get a notification every single time i upload thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next one gotta do what i gotta do